Dark matter is an unidentified type of matter that does not emit or interact with electromagnetic radiation, such as light, and is therefore invisible to the entire electromagnetic spectrum. Even though it's not on the spectrum, dark matter is what connects galaxies across the cosmos, almost like a web. Researchers have finally captured the first image of dark matter, and I'm going to tell you all about it right now on IO. What is good, space potatoes? This is Inform Overload, and my name is Charlotte Dobre. Scientists have known for years that there's something that holds the cosmos together. Together, like a massive gravitational spider web. That something is dark matter, and it's very, very hard to observe, even though scientists know that it's there. It makes up around 27% of our universe, and it doesn't give off, reflect, or absorb light. Something that doesn't emit light is incredibly hard to detect. The only way to detect dark matter is by observing its gravitational pull, or when it warps the light of distant galaxies. Researchers Mike Hudson and Seth Epps have created what they say is the first composite image of a dark matter matter filament that connects galaxies together, shown here. They did this through a technique called weak gravitational lensing. It's a statistical measurement of the slight bends that occur in the path of light passing near mass. They combined lensing data from a sky survey that took multiple years, using the Canada-France-Hawaii telescope plus info from the Sloan Digital Sky Survey. Basically the end result is an illustration of galaxies that look like they're warped thanks to the presence of dark matter. Mike Hudson is a professor of astronomy at the University of Waterloo in Canada, and Seth Epps is a master's student at the University of Waterloo. They explained in their paper, By using this technique, we were not only able to see that these dark matter filaments in the universe exist, we were able to see the extent to which these filaments connect galaxies together. Dark matter is extremely important to understand how our universe began. It's one of the fundamental aspects of the Big Bang Theory. The theory predicts that variation in the density of matter right at the beginning of the universe led to the bulk of the matter in the cosmos to condense into a web of tangled filaments. In order to make sense of this, astronomer Fritz Zwicky introduced the concept of dark matter back in 1933. He measured galaxies in a galaxy cluster, and he concluded that there must be more than 10 times more invisible matter than visible matter. Hudson and Epps hope that future surveys of the sky will continue to further our understanding of dark matter. Alright friends, it's time to respond to some comments. Melanie Munoz said, Charlotte, can I be in your video if I call you Charlotte? Yes. Yes, you may. Aaron Shoemaker said, Hey Charlotte, what do you call the children of the corn's father? Popcorn. <laughs> Good one. That is all for now. Thanks for watching IO, and I will see you in another video.